So the Atlantic circulation includes something we think of almost like a, a giant conveyor belt where there are waters at the surface of the Atlantic that move north and they eventually sink as they become cold and salty and dense enough to do so and they sink both to the west and to the east of Greenland and that overall conveyor belt or overturning circulation as we call it is potentially vulnerable to both slowing down and potentially shutting off in a future warmer world. The thing that can break the circulation, cause it to reach a tipping point, uh, is if the waters become not dense enough to sink, which means if they become fresher from the addition of melt water from nearby ice sheets or because of warming. Possible impacts of a weakening or collapse of the Atlantic overturning circulation in Europe, well they might include winters becoming actually rather more bitter and severe than they are at the present. Even if on average the year is warmer, we would certainly expect some changes in the nature of our climate, especially actually in Western Europe and in, in the UK, where the ocean and its heat transport really plays a big role in keeping, for example, the UK climate quite mild and famously drizzly and uh, <laughs> unpleasant. Uh, instead, we would actually see, I think, a more continental climate with more extreme seasonality if we lost some of the influence of heat transport from the Atlantic Ocean.